This is Jennifer Batten for Rome by Wild. First of all, I'd like to know if you can share any memory of your concert, your past concerts in Italy. Yeah, I, I remember the first time in Italy very, very well, because it was the first time in Europe, first time out of America, yeah, the Bad Tour 1987. We opened in Rome, and um, I remember I, all the shows we had done prior to that, it was dark, it was inside, it was dark, so all the lights worked, and Rome in the summer, it didn't get dark. <laughs> so <laughs> that was one of the things I remember. And I also remember it well because we had a lot of time to really see the city. It wasn't just gig, move to another city, another city. We took one day to go to the Forum, another day for the Coliseum. It was awesome. And um, uh, can you share any memory, memory about your experience with Michael Jackson? Yeah, um, playing with Michael was like a paid vacation. You know, it was really fun. I was a fan of his music before I got in his band, so that always helps. <laughs> um, and it was just a load of fun. E everybody in the band got along, which doesn't always happen. It's probably 50-50. And we still stay in contact today. Um, so it, it was just really, really good, fun memories for everybody. How did you receive the, his passing away? Uh, not well. It, um, you know, rather than sad, I, I was angry. Just angry at how he had been treated. And the sadness is for his children. enough to hear about the auditions for Michael. He auditioned about 100 people um, and one of his guys called, uh, I was teaching at Musicians Institute in Hollywood, so we were lucky enough to get a call. They said bring us two people and I was one of the people they called. So you know, I went and auditioned, a couple days later I got a call that he was interested and it was a matter of coming down and playing with the band and see how it goes. And I played with the band for a month. Um, there was the band in one room, singers in one room, dancers in one room, and after that month we all got together in a big sound stage with Michael and all the special effects and worked for another month. So that was awesome. What are you doing now? What I'm doing now is a, a lot of a lot of different things. I, I do a solo multimedia show with films that I've made. So I do a lot of that. I do guitar workshops, um, play with different impersonators sometimes. And I, I have my own show that we're launching um, in a, a week, I guess, in Colorado. And. Um, playing with different bands. I'm coming back to Italy in March playing with Stu Hamm and Chad Wackerman from Frank Zappa's band um, and Natarena Zacconi. Uh, so there's a lot, a lot going on. I'm always having to learn new music. You know, I mean, this is my last show in Italy tonight and I'm already working on songs for next week and then a completely different show a week after that. So I'm very, very busy. Are you still having fun on stage? Not every night, but for the most part, yes. Yeah, enough that I keep doing it. <laughs> okay, so thank you very much for this interview sure. and for answering our questions.